Hello everyone, and welcome to my The Young and the Restless official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Spoilers for the next episodes of The Young and the Restless for January 29, February 9 indicate that there will be some love developments and dangerous scenes. Chance Chancellor and Summer Newman will commemorate their first official date with a very flirtatious supper over the week of January 29, February 2. Nikki Newman's proposal for Audra Charles to oversee the Newman Media branch in London will be turned down. According to Y and R teasers, Audra will be let go instead, forcing her to choose a different career path. Audra will provide Nate Heistings with updates and let him know that Nikki's termination would be advantageous because she has already been making suggestions to him about taking over Glockade. Audra may now devote all of her time and efforts to this takeover scheme. Since she won't have to worry about losing her job at Newman Media, she can even accept a position at Tucker McCall's business and work against him there. Sooner or later, Tucker will also make life difficult for Kyle Abbott, which will put Kyle in a position where he must justify his job at Jebot. Diane Jenkins Abbott's appointment as co-CEO may cause Tucker to irritate Kyle by suggesting that Mommy should be given priority over him. Tucker would severely mistrust Kyle's claim that he fully supports Diane in her new post. According to Y and R teasers, Kyle will have an outburst, which is undoubtedly the kind of response Tucker is hoping for. Tucker's favorite pastime is gradually turning into getting under Kyle's skin. Ashley Abbott and Tressy Abbott will travel to Paris and visit the cafe where she had her famous altercation with Tucker, which led to two different accounts of what happened and a great deal of controversy. Ashley was initially completely persuaded of her version of events, Ashley needs to find out the truth and determine whether Tucker is gaslighting her because she's beginning to question her sanity a little bit. Why and our viewers are aware that Tucker sincerely believes his story because we've seen him remember that day in a bewildered manner, even in situations where Ashley isn't around? Will the person Ashley and Tracy speak with on the cafe's wait staff be able to assist? Ashley is hopeful that someone would remember something, but it's possible that security camera footage from a neighboring location could turn up. Ashley can only see the truth with her own eyes in this manner. Daniel Romolotti Jr. will come to a discovery about Heather Stevens and what he believes to be the truth about her once he returns to Gino City. Will Daniel come to a realization that causes him to second-guess his choice to reconcile with Heather? Daniel might question whether he's making the right choice because we know he'll be split between Heather and Lily Winters during the February sweepstakes. However, it's also feasible that after Lily returns from California, Daniel will just be conflicted about hurting her. In that scenario, Daniel may come to the idea that he is unable to avoid Heather. Daniel may realize that it's going to be more difficult than he anticipated and end up hooking up with Heather once more in spite of his attempts to hit pause. Billy Abbott has promised to help Chelsea Lawson in her hour of need, so it appears that this has something to do with Connor Newman's declining grades and the problems he's experiencing at school. Adam Newman is about to receive a gift from Sally Spectra, as Billy comforts Chelsea on some parenting challenges, that can lead to Adam and Sally's romance becoming even more intense. Victor Newman will be informed about Jordan's escape from prison or his death as a result of a fire that occurred there. Jordan is extremely cunning, so it goes without saying that she will escape the fire and get ready to attack the Newmans once more. Although Victor will alert his family, it appears that Cole Howard and Victoria Newman will choose to keep Claire Grace in the dark. Nikki and Jack will prevent a near accident at work, but they will not be able to stave off Victor's anger forever. Victor will subsequently catch Nikki with Jack. Consequently, he will bust the pair and seemingly discover that Jack has been secretly sponsoring her. Victor should then confront Jack about the deception, but since Nikki came up with the scheme, she might jump to his defense. There will be additional mayhem around Jordan's jailbreak, and the retaliation she is still planning against the Newmans throughout the week of February 5-9. Will Jordan take the next step and move forward? 
The trust that Victoria and Cole have been fostering may be harmed if Claire eventually finds out that they have been concealing Jordan's getaway from her. Jack will make arrangements for a reliable replacement for Audra's position, while Nikki searches for a new CEO. Since Noah Newman is scheduled to return home shortly, he might be the one to slip in. Next, Phyllis Summers will pursue Danny Romolotti with unwavering determination, which will finally lead to some progress and enrage Christine Blair. Watch this space for more mayhem involving a love triangle. Spoilers for The Young and the Restless indicate that Summer Newman and Chance Chancellor will have a light-hearted discussion on January 29, but there may be more to it than meets the eye. Chance and Summer want to keep the conversation light as they pose questions to one another as it will be their first formal date. Chance would playfully predict that next summer will claim she doesn't like lettuce, peanut butter, and mayonnaise sandwiches after pretending to be horrified at Summer's contempt for watermelon. Summer will confess that eating that combination could actually be her death sentence as soon as she realizes how disgusting it sounds. Summer will clarify that she truly suffers from a serious peanut allergy, defying Chance's assumption that she is being dramatic. Longtime viewers of Y and R are aware of this, of course, as Summers previously experienced an allergic response on the show. Based on the hints in this chat, may Summer be planning another one? Chance tells Summer that he's surprised by her news, and then tells her that he would act quickly if she ever experienced an allergic reaction in front of him. Chance will mention later in the conversation that he never forgets anything Summer tells him, which may be advantageous given that she has now disclosed to him her peanut allergy. What happens in the not-too-distant future if Summer inadvertently consumes anything that contains peanuts? That might prompt Chance to act as he had promised, saving Summer's life in the process. In the interim, of course, there may be some terrifying experiences, which may serve to highlight for Chance the significance of Summer in his life. It would be a terrific way to advance this relationship, and Chance might even declare his love for Summer as a result. Even if Chance is no longer a police officer, he can still have his moment of heroism if he rescues Summer when she's in danger. In any case, this entire peanut allergy problem might resurface and endanger Summer. Therefore, be sure to check back for updates on any upcoming surprises. According to previews for The Young and the Restless, Summer and Chance are planning some unexpected moves. Have you joined our Facebook group, Official Why and Our Early Recaps, Spoilers and News, yet? Enjoy chatting with other like-minded Why and Our fans in our group, which is dedicated to recaps, spoilers, rumors, gossip, and comings and goings. So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.